Many decorate their yards in spooky decor this time of year, but one local family is a lot more dedicated, changing their Halloween display every day. Wow, every day. KSET photojournalist Asian Bermia has their story. Every time we think of an idea, we kind of jot it down and then we pick the best ones. After it gets dark, we change them out. The kids like to help out, so it's a fun thing for the family to do together. We just like to think of funny puns and sometimes we go uh, and make the themes based off of the pun that we've thought of and sometimes we do the theme and then think of a pun to go with it. So, yep, we did the hunting one, haunting for deer. The deer was in the blind. We've never really decorated for Halloween before, but I think we went all out this year. Like last year, I think all we did was grab like a light up pumpkin over there and just said happy Halloween. Today we did a work of artery by Leonardo da Vinci and he painted the Bona Lisa. It's really fun doing the, uh, the skeletons with my family and sometimes things don't go quite right. This morning the ladder fell over. We did one with the mermaid tail yeah. and they were getting their skeleton on. Gordon Ramsay. Uh-huh, it was Gore Dead Ramsay. The scientist. Albert Feinstein. Oh, yes. <laughs> My favorite one was the Hawaii one. We did a carnival themed one and instead of a cotton candy stand, it was a, a rotten candy. Oh my gourd, Becky, look at that bat. We did Twister. Oh, we did do a zip line, yep. But the zip line one, we almost ended up ripping the, one of the lanterns out of our house. We've gotten a couple of neighbors that have walked by and said that they actually take their walks to purposely go by to see what they're doing daily. So we started the 1st of October and we'll go through Halloween. Hopefully on Halloween, I think we're gonna do more of an interactive one where you can take a picture with them. It's worth it just to uh, make somebody smile. We hope everyone enjoys it.